Hey guys, what's up? I am back with the brand new video and it's time to do a speed test comparison between the Poco F3 versus the Samsung Galaxy A52. And guys, and the Samsung Galaxy A52 has a mid range Qualcomm Snapdragon 720G chipset with 8GB of RAM, while the Poco F3 has a Qualcomm Snapdragon 870 processor with 8GB of RAM. And this is a flagship processor from Qualcomm, and also we have 8GB of RAM. On the back, we have a quad cameras on the Samsung Galaxy A52. We have a main 64 megapixel main camera with optical image stabilization on the A52. While on the Poco F3 has a triple cameras on the back, we have a main 48 megapixel main camera with no optical image stabilization. And the A52 also has IP67 water and dust resistance. And the main highlight about the Poco F3 is not the cameras, it's the processor as well as the display. So without any wasting time, let's get right into it. Now let's see that which one is going to be the fastest one. Then both phones is completely off. Now let's quickly boot both of these phones up at the same time here we go and the logo is here more faster on the galaxy a52 as compared to the poco f3 and both phones is running on android 11 we have samsung one y 3.1 as compared to me y version 12 and this phone also support 5g as well because we have a snapdragon 870 and you can see on the poco f3 it is a much much faster phone when it comes to booting up and the A52 is take a lot of time and you can see huge difference between these two devices when it comes to booting up and now the A52 it is also done you can see about 8 or 9 second difference maybe more between these two devices when it comes to booting up and guess you can see that in both phones has a beautiful display we have a full HD AMOLED display on the Poco F3 with a 120Hz refresh rate display while the Galaxy A52 has a full HD Super AMOLED display with 90 hertz refresh rate display and both phones also has a punch hole which is really really small on the poco f3 even more smaller than the samsung galaxy a52 and you can see and guys also on the bottom chain it is also really small on the poco f3 as compared to the a52 and also in the poco f3 it is a little bit more expensive phone than the samsung galaxy a52 okay guys everything's closed up in the background no app is running in the background and also we have same wi-fi network on both phones now let's quickly launch the phone dialer and faster on the poco f3 followed by the a52 so next on the list is the settings that is more faster again on the poco f3 as compared to the a52 now let's see amazon shopping on both phones now let's see that who is faster there and that is exactly the same and you can see that's really interesting now let's see the scrolling and that is feels really smooth on the poco f3 because we have 120 hertz as compared to 90 hertz on the galaxy a52 now let's check out some games application now let's start off with the candy crush saga and you can see in this way we will see the real difference between these two devices and you can see much faster on the poco f3 now let's see the pinout on both phones here we go again more faster on the f3 and you can see let's see sub suffer and again huge faster on the poco f3 but this way this time faster on the a52 and you can see so that's a really interesting result a52 is speed the poco f3 so now let's see temper and two and that is faster definitely on the poco f3 poco f3 it is done and now the A52 it is also done so you can see that huge difference between these two devices so now let's see snapchat faster on the poco f3 one thing it is also really good on the A52 is that when you go to the camera application and when you go to the right there and this is a mode which is called as fun and this mode give you a snapchat filters right in your camera application which means that and the snapchat video quality as well as the photo quality should be really good on the a52 as compared to any other android phone so now let's see spotify faster on the poco f3 instagram and that is little bit more faster on the a52 opening up the tutor faster just a tiny bit on the f3 zetch and that is exactly the same on both phones no difference there now let's see the scrolling and that is face really smooth on the poco f3 i see a little bit lag on the a52 i don't know why because i never seen this lag before on my a52 now let's quickly launch 
the PUBG mobile game on both phones. And now let's see that who is faster there. Again, we have a Qualcomm Snapdragon 870 processor as compared to the mid-range Qualcomm Snapdragon 720G. And Poco F3 it is done. And now the Galaxy A5200 is also done. And both phones also has those speakers really good on the Poco F3 as compared to the A52. And last time I launched the cameras on both phones, default camera app faster on the Poco F3 as compared to the A52. Now let's see internet browsing speed. I am using the first Samsung internet browser on the A52 as compared to Google Chrome on the Poco F3, Wikipedia.org. Faster, just a tiny bit on the Poco F3, not a huge difference. Now let's see the scrolling and that is way more smoother on the Poco F3 because again we have 120Hz as compared to 90Hz. Let's open this English language and that is just a tiny bit again more faster on the Poco F3. Next on the list is the WWE.com and it is a little bit heavy website and you can see really really fast on both phones very similar as well very hard to tell who is faster there now let's see the scrolling and that is face uh, really smooth on the Poco F3 but on the A52 it is also 90 hertz no lag right now so guys now let's check out RAM management on both phones both phones has 8 GB of RAM and also we have a lot of apps in the background phone dialer no refresh let's see settings no refresh Amazon shopping no refresh it is an internet refresh let's see candy crush saga no refresh let's see pin out no refresh subway suffer same result let's see temper and two let's see snapchat let's see spotify no refresh instagram now let's see the twitter that is not refresh as well let's see zedge you can see so far ram match man it is absolutely incredible on both phones now let's see pubg mobile that is also not refresh on both phones and you can see that both phones is performed so far really good so last way back to the internet browser where we left and you can see that is also not refresh on both phones and guys what i have to say regarding the app's opening speed as you can see that in every application and poco f3 it is more faster than the Samsung Galaxy A52. In terms of the RAM management wise, both phones is perform really good in the RAM management. No refresh on both phones. So that's about it. And thank you so much for watching this speed test comparison between the Poco F3 versus the Samsung Galaxy A52. And the Poco F3, it is a base phone in this price range. I definitely recommend the Poco F3 if you want a best gaming phone in this price range. And let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And subscribe to my channel for daily tech videos follow me on instagram and twitter as well and i will catch you in my next video peace out